efforts, it holds to America the land of opportunity. Now, whether you accepted or rejected for being either disease-ridden, anarchists, criminals, uh, you know, maybe didn't have much skills, or maybe had so little money that we'd be the ones that would have to support you, everybody had to pass our beautiful statue. Her name is Liberty Enlightening the World. Now, France gave us a statue as a gift to show their friendship for the United States, a friendship which we still hold dear between our two republics even today. They chose a young man named Frederick Augusto Bartoli to build the statue. He used very thin sheets of copper material, a process known as repose, which is That's a French again. word meaning to push forward. In order to support very thin skin that is the equivalent thickness of just two USA copper pennies side by side, she's supported by a dress-like interior frame by Gustave Eiffel, created the Eiffel Tower in France. She holds a torch that's planned 24 karat gold leaf. She's facing the direction of the uh, French people who gave us this lovely gift. She's sending out her message of freedom across seven seas and continents, which are represented by the points in the statue's crown. In her other hand, she's holding a tablet. It could be a Kindle, it might be an iPad, I'm not really sure. Okay, it's actually a book of law. Accident in Roman numerals is our date of independence of July 4th, 1776. And we'll start from